Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, hi, my name is Mackenzie. For today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got for people, what? I'm gonna be showing you guys what I got people for Christmas. If you are my family, please go ahead and um, hit the road, Jack. Get out of here. You don't peek. I already texted some of my family and I was like, if I post a what I got people for Christmas, but you guys promise you won't go look at what you got? And they all said, yeah, you better really know. I'm coming for you. Every year since I started YouTube, I've always wanted to do these, but I've always went back and forth because I just know that people in my life will look. Like for me, I was the complete opposite. Like if I accidentally saw a present, my whole life was ruined. But let's just get right on in to the first person, which will be my mom. What I got my mom was this comfy, cozy pajama set from Marshalls. I just feel like this is so, oh, it's this way. Oh my god. And I love things that come in the sets at Marshalls. These were on my holiday gift guide if you guys want to go see there. But these look really cozy. Also the roses I just love because like the flower for cystic fibrosis is roses. So love these. And then these were not supposed to be a thing that I got. But I just saw them and needed to get them for her because she loves shoes. Shoes. If you guys hear like a truck or something going backwards, I don't know. It literally wasn't doing that the whole time, but of course, since I started, you know, recording, it was like, oh, I better back up the truck for the rest of the day. Like, okay. So I got her these really cute Dan Skin shoes from Marshalls as well. I just feel like they're really cute, and I may or may have not got her in a size five and a half so that I could wear them myself. Shop smarter, not harder. And these are so cute. And also, they match her backpack that I got her. So, I got her this backpack because she has this one. But it's like just, like, meh. It's just like a meh. You know, it's just like one she needed to get. But it's not cute. It's like this. And it's a beige color. As you can see. It's really, really cute though. Like, the design is cute. The one she has now is just like plain black. And I'm like, mom, let's upgrade a little bit. Okay? So, and then it comes with this little wristlet. You know, that you can put your cards, your money, your phone, whatever in. And then it comes with a little tiny wallet, which I just think is really cute. So, love that. And I think she'll really like this. I was going back and forth between gray and beige. But I think beige is the way to go. Especially after I got the shoes. I was just like, yeah. So now I'm going to do my dad. Because we're kind of going to do it like in groups and segments. That like makes sense. So, the first thing I got my dad. <laughs> I always get, okay. I always get my dad like different types of trail mixes or like chocolates or something. He just loves this type of stuff, so I got him the Salted Caramel Indulgent Trail Mix, Salted Caramel Flavored Chocolate Truffles, Salted Caramel Flavored Cashews, Roasted Salted Almonds, Dark Chocolate Pretzels, and Pretzel Balls. So I feel like he'll really, really like this. Two graphic tees, and then before I show you guys the graphic tees, my sisters and I went on, went in on a hammer drill for construction. If you guys don't know, my dad is a construction worker. He's been a construction worker for forever. I wish I could hear. My ears are kind of plugged. Hammer drill is like his bigger gift. And then I got him this. I hope you guys can see this, but it says Cotton Heading Ninja Muggins from um, Elf. I actually got this from a gas station. So I got this from the Flying J gas stations. Guys, Flying J's like don't sleep on them. They're so good. Kind of feel like you're at, you know, the Ritz Carlton. And then the next graphic tee I got him, which I said in my holiday gift guide, like to get your dad graphic tees. I told you guys, my dad still wears his Hakuna Matata one. So I'm like, he better wear these and appreciate them. I got him this one and it says, I don't have superpowers, but I'm a pop pop, so close enough. Which I just feel like is so him. Because his dad passed away when he was younger, when he was in his early 20s, and he was pop pop, so my dad is pop pop to my sister's kids. To go along with my dad, I got his girlfriend, Jen, two things. So I got her this mega cookie double chocolate chunk and it's a pan cookie mix, so it comes with a pan, which I just think is really fun. Like if we go out to dinner, we're always like, oh my God, we have to get the chocolate cake or we have to get the chocolate lava cake or anything. So I was like, this is perfect. And then the next thing I got her is also from The Flying J and it is this graphic tee and it says, OMG, Santa. And then it says, I know him, I know him from elf love that because we always quote elf together next people are going to be the fresh household so this is my sister 
her husband, and my nephew, Haven. So the first thing that I got, I'm going to start with Kimberly, which is my sister, like I said. I got her this really cute bobby pin holder, and it says hashtag mom life. I just think this is perfect because if you know Kimberly, I feel like her signature hairstyle is her bun. <laughs> so you need bobby pins, and this is brunette. This is perfect, and I just feel like the hashtag mom life is so fitting. This gift is kind of like a themed gift. So Kimberly started coaching a volleyball team, a travel volleyball team here in Tennessee, and so the three gifts that I got her all have to do with that. So the first thing that I got actually isn't here yet. It is a coaching bag. It's like all black and it set, it's from Etsy. It's all black and it says, it has a volleyball in the middle like on top and then below it, it says Coach Kimberly. So I think that that will be really, really, really cute for her. It's in all white and I'm excited. So to go along with that, I got her a pair of the 90 Degree by Reflex leggings. I got her another black pair with pockets, of course, and I've talked about these so many times. Like, this is just the best legging brand that you'll ever have. Like, it's just so, so good. Like, they don't fall down. I feel like they're, like, tummy control, even though she does not need it. She has, like, a beautiful stomach, but that's besides the point. Um, but I'm excited about these. And then, to go along with that as well, I got her a 90 degree reflex jacket. So I just got her this nice gray color, and it does have, like, the thumb holes. I just feel like she has a black one, so I was like, I don't want to get her another black one. Even though I got another black pair of leggings because I just feel like you can never have enough black pair of leggings, you know? Athletic jackets, athletic clothes are perfect for coaching volleyball. Then the next thing is for Jacob. So this is Haven's, this is my brother-in-law, Haven's dad, Kimberly's husband. He is a producer, he's a singer-songwriter here in Nashville. It's a gel wrist rest mouse pad. So while he's editing, producing, he has somewhere to rest his wrist because I know just from editing, you know, it is a lot on the wrist. So this is perfect. The next thing I got him, this is funny. This looks like an inside joke, so I don't really know if it'll hit. It's supposed to be like how you put your college degree inside of here. So he actually talked to Gavin DeGraw himself in Instagram DMs. And that's like his idol. I think it's so, so cool that he was able to talk to him and like especially it being his idol. So what I want to do is I want to print out the conversation because he sent it to me to show me. And I want to say like, you know, this certificate is for, or like congratulations, something of like you talked to Gavin DeGraw in the DMs. Like he answered you kind of thing. And just kind of make it funny and then he can put it in his producing room or whatever, like in his studio. Okay, next person is Haven, which I'm so excited about. So the first thing I got for him is this, guess how much I love you? coloring books so he loves guess how much i love you it's a new show that i honestly never even heard about before haven but it's just this coloring book and it looks just like the tv show and i'm excited for him to just scribble in there and then to go along with colors i got him this baby touch and feel color book so these are the ones where you like open them up and then you can feel what the actual objects in real life feel like a teddy bear glass of milk things like that so so excited for that another coloring thing is this double doodle board i love this because when i was younger crayola magic markers were my absolute favorite and so i was like i want him to get a little piece of what i love so i got him this and then the last few things also speak me being his aunt i love pretzels if you're my family if you're my best friends well you shouldn't be watching this video but if you watch it after but you know that i love love pretzels that's like my thing you're kidding like i got him a pretzel onesie you're literally joking so this is the burt's bees brand 18 months and these are perfect because they're cotton and organic and really good for baby skin. So I'm so excited. Like the fact that it has pretzels on it makes my life, you know. Then the last thing I got him is this basketball set. I'm excited about this. So you hook this onto either your tub wall or your faucet. And you just go to town with some basketball. So so excited about this he loves putting things into places so i'm excited i think he'll really really like these and so next household is my sister bethany my brother-in-law austin and then their baby to be coming soon coming in february january sometime soon so the first thing i got for my sister is she is obsessed with little mermaid ariel that's like her disney person of all time so i got her this mug as if she needs any more mugs, like I'm sorry, Bethany, but I had to get this. It was screaming at me. So I got her this and she loves like the really big mugs that holds a lot of coffee. So I was like, okay, like this is perfect. If I don't get this, I'm stupid. So it has like the little fork, the whole thing. 
it's just perfect. Like, I'm so excited to give this to her. The next thing I got her was a mini wet brush in her favorite color blue, which is like this light blue. So I'm really excited to give this to her because I got her one and then something happened. I forget, but it got ruined. And I'm like excited about this anyway because this is like her color, so she'll really, really love it. And everyone needs a wet brush. Like, everyone needs a wet brush. So the last two things I got Bethany were from Target. They're these nightgowns that look so cozy and comfy. I just got her black and gray because I just feel like neutral is her color palette all the time. She really, she actually had these on her list. I'm excited to give these to her for postpartum just so it's like easy access to just like rip off or like go from underneath to go to the bathroom or breastfeed or it's just like really, really conducive to pregnancy and postpartum. And the last thing for Bethany and the baby, honestly, is this set so her theme in her nursery is like bears and adventure the mountains it's really like the tennessee mountains is like the theme of her whole nursery and bears so i got her this little set and it says baby bear and i just think this is so so cute and we love this the next thing i got her for austin my brother-in-law bethany's husband so he is a diehard football fan in specific ut so university of tennessee and so i got him these ornaments they were screaming at me at marshall's and i literally was like wait just like the aerial mug this is perfect and again i'll be stupid if i don't get these so he has a ut tree that he puts up every year so i got him this really cute little converse ornament and it says it has the University of Tennessee logo on it. And then I also got him this little gnome with the football, Tennessee orange. And then I also got him a cup. But it's just perfect. And it says Evolve for Life. We are the volunteer state. So that is where UT got their name. And it's just perfect. Like I had to get it. I love when presents like that just jump out of you and basically buy themselves. And you're just like, okay, good to go. Okay, the next person i say person because he is my best person is my dog jackson so the first thing that i got him was this little toy basket and it says life is better with the dog so he has a toy basket right now but it's so small this is perfect it's so cute from marshall's and then i just kind of put two things in there I got this junk food dog toy i just think this is so funny so it's supposed to be like bugles but it's beagles and it just has the little beagles and then the last thing in here is this little shirt and it says zero sniffs given the last and final person is my best friend Paige. it's a tradition that we get each other christmas gifts every year and birthday gifts we started this i feel like when we were literally like 10 years old and we've just done it every year the first thing that i got we're gonna start small is this Lindor's chocolate. This is the limited edition sugar cookie white chocolate truffles. Love these. I bought myself some too because duh. So she said she needed a really good makeup setting spray. So I got her the Stay All Night Microfine Setting Spray from e.l.f. This is such a good setting spray and so affordable. So, you know, she can replace it if she loves it as much as I do. So I'm excited about that. The next thing is the Brazilian Crush Body Mist. Guys, I've talked about this in countless number of videos. It's the best ever. It was in my holiday gift guide. I've talked about it, I feel like, for the last two years. It's just so, so good. I'm excited for her to have it. And then also, in the same brand, I got her the Brazilian Kiss Lip Butter. This stuff is so good. It is literally a cookie for your lips like you taste cookie it's so so good the next thing that i got her is so this is supposed to be more of like a crew neck material it's not it's still really cute though so hopefully it she likes shirts that go like past her butt so i hope that that goes past her butt but it's just this really pretty pink it's literally just like a basic long sleeve and hopefully it goes past her butt like i said but i like the color so i hope she likes it too and then the last two things are wedding related so the first thing is this cute Cosmetic bag, makeup bag, toiletry bag, whatever she wants to put in here. This just screams wedding bride. She can either take it on her honeymoon or she can just take it, you know, after a wedding anywhere. Wherever she wants to take it, I'm excited for this. This is so cute. It's just like a so bride to me. Like the pearls and the white, I just love this. So I'm excited for her to have that. And then the last thing is for her and Nick, her fiance, soon to be husband. So it's wrapped in here. This comes in this little box. I need to like rewrap it and make it really cute, but it's like this. 
and I hope you guys can see it, but it's this little jar and it says honeymoon and then the O's, which I think is really cute, is like the rings, which is just so cool. So what you do is you open up the corkscrew and you put your sand from your honeymoon inside and like shells and things to remind yourself of the honeymoon, which I think is really cute. I know they are going to a tropical location, so I had to make sure of that first. Yeah, so I'm like so excited for that. I'm so excited for that. But that was it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share for more content. Today's subscriber shout out goes to Paige Hartley, my best friend herself. And just because, you know, you're getting married and it's just going to be a really, really exciting time coming up, you know, with her bachelorette party, or her bridal shower, everything that's coming up, all the wedding festivities, it's going to be so fun within this new year. So she's going to be my subscriber shout out for today. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.